original vision with ATI was to have an office based in Southern California and uh, to service mostly that region doing asbestos work and restoration emergency type services. We started at one location just with myself and two others to 14 locations and over 650 employees uh, the last 25 years. I think the key to success is, is hands down is my father's leadership. He leads by example. I mean, my dad personally ran catastrophe operations during Hurricane Sandy. There's not many CEOs that probably even step foot. He teaches you hard work, integrity, and dedication to the job. We had to work from the ground up all the way through every stage of the company in order to get to where we are today. The employees last here a long time because we treat them extremely well, and it comes from the top down. It comes from Gary Moore. He's an engaged uh, owner. He knows the people, knows the clients, and I think that the clients and the employees feel they know Gary and certainly know what he stands for. We've been working with him quite a few years now. It's one of the best companies to work with because they treat everybody really well. They do a lot with the uh, community. They get involved with various charities. The exciting thing about working for ATI is that they're always the first ones to get involved in something that the industry's not used to, like our healthcare program that we're doing now. What I'm excited about right now is the health science services. We're getting into nanotechnology, hydrogen peroxide vapor, ultraviolet light. So what we're doing is we're decontaminating viruses, bacteria, in pharmacies and in laboratories. Where the future is going is just very exciting. ATI is a full service insurance restoration contractor specializing in fire damage, water damage, reconstruction, health care, asbestos and lead, and environmental work. A lot of other companies out there only do one trade whereas we do all of them. With ATI, the beauty is you've got one single point of contact, you've got one project manager, you've got one company that's gonna take you from cradle to grave. We're available 24-7, 365. Every situation, every scenario is different from the one you just came from. It keeps us busy, keeps us on our toes. There's never a dull moment here. There was a fire here, over 116 rooms affected of demolition throughout. This is a good example of what actually was happening as the fire concluded. Pretty much the ceiling was down to the floor. So basically what we're doing right now is just demolition, opening of the walls, just kind of drying it in here, cleaning up the walls, removing the affected drywalls. A lot of toilets, sinks, uh, tubs are going to be detached and of course leave it ready for the reconstruction point. This was a 35 unit apartment fire. It burned six units in the center of this area here completely to the ground. There were some heavy structural framing issues and, and concrete steel issues that occurred down below grade here. Once that got out of the ground, then we framed and we are now shooting our brown coat on and getting that all cleaned up. Meanwhile, on the interior, everything here is brand new. We're in the drywall stage here. The drywall's hung, so we should be wrapped up, ready for cabinets and finished items coming very quickly at that point. I think for the first four years of my career, Gary didn't expose that we were doing structure work, but after that he realized that we were pretty successful at it and it seemed that the industry was moving towards that direction, so we went full bore uh, construction division and we've never looked back. I wanted to bring you into one of our job sites due to a fire-related damage of Christmas decorations right before the holidays. Right now, the house has been packed out. Everything's at our uh, climate control facility. We've had to go through the home. We re plastered the walls, had to clean all the stone. We soda blasted every bit of the stones that you're gonna see on the walls and the ceiling. The textiles throughout the entire house were taken out and cleaned. The water did go throughout once the sprinklers kicked off and it damaged the flooring in here, which we did replace. There's a sense of satisfaction knowing that I can go to a homeowner, a business owner, and tell them this will be new again, this will be as good or better than it was before this happened. 
We just opened up the technical services division, getting into more of the big plant type equipment, so we don't need to go outside of our company in order to handle the equipment. It lessens the out-of-pocket expense of the insurance company. We're able to get that client's production back up, and we can go on the back end and do the construction services that's needed as well. ATI services are not limited to large commercial or individual residential customers. In the consulting division alone, we've worked on claims as small as $5,000 on someone's swimming pool, and so we're not afraid of any job too large or too small. I think we're very unique. I think the diversity in services that we provide allows us to help a wide variety of customers and clients. We're very professional in what we do. We take pride in the quality, the craftsmanship. We just stand above our competition. We're very customer service focused and oriented. We've built our business on repeat customers. You know, happy customer gives out to referrals, and uh, we're a referral-based company. It's those customers that are gonna continue to grow us. So the better we can treat them, whether it be emergency services all the way through the end of construction, the better we are as a company. They have qualified professionals. They're there to get the job done, to make sure that the end result is, is a good one for you know, any client that we're dealing with. You would know then that anything that you're gonna be dealing with this company, it's gonna be handled with care because it's just the way they operate. They seem to really care about the people that work for them and the people they work for. We treat our employees very respectfully and uh, they end up being respectful as well and, and loyal and we still have a few employees that started with me 25 years ago. Everybody just works as, as a team, as a family. And it is a family owned business. That translates down the ladder into all the offices where it's just a family, it's an ATI family. A family business is very important. To me it's uh, consistency. We want to grow as a family and uh, we want employees to grow with us. Over the last 18 years, I've seen us grow into the Midwest and into the East Coast, and uh, I see our expansion taking us all over the United States within the next 15 years. We need to be everywhere in every major city to truly be a national corporation. If we continue with the 10% or greater growth in revenue, we'll be a billion dollar company. I think within 25 years. Obviously, my dad will be retired at that point. Me and my brothers will be running operation. Most recently, uh, we've attended some family uh, succession conferences and workshops, and uh, just recently we've hired a person to kind of help us transition to that uh, second generation. To me, it means everything. You know, I take pride in what I do. I, I love what I do. And I'm just so grateful that I'm able to work for this company. This is our 25th anniversary. I'm hoping 25 years from now, my brothers and I are having the same type of talks with our kids and our succession planning on how they can eventually take over the company and continue the success and growth that we've had over the past 25 years. You know, working for your father and working with the same people and over and over again, it's, it's very rewarding, you know, knowing that I'm working every day with my brothers and working with my best friends and it's an amazing opportunity to work for a family business and have something else to leave behind for your children and to live for and to work for every day.